Hello, hello, and welcome to Fosberg Live. I'm Melanie Finney, and I'm here with Kyrie Blackman, a junior here at FSU. He will be playing the lead role in Father Comes Home from the Wars, Part 1, 2, and 3. The show opens tomorrow, Friday, March 3rd, and will be held in the studio theater. For those of you who aren't familiar with the pack, as soon as you come in, take a right, and the theater is tucked in on the corner. Tickets are on sale now, and we'll tell you how to get them at the end of the broadcast. But let's get started with the show. It sounds like it's going to be powerful. <laughs> Kari, how are you today? I am good. That's good. Yeah. <laughs> so tell us about the show. Um, well, I'm not going to spoil anything, but the show is its really intense. It's real raw, gritty. Um, it's about a slave who, whose master gives him the choice to go to the war and fight for the Confederacy with him, which is obviously the wrong side. And um, he's really torn between whether or not he should go with his master or stay with his family. And, you know, that's basically all, all I can give you without, like, spoiling <laughs> without it. Without spoiling it, yeah. I understand. <laughs> <laughs> so who is Hero? How would you describe him? Hero is a very conflicted person. He's a slave, so he has a slave mindset. But it's also, he's, he, he, he kind of drifts between opinions because of everyone who's on the plantation with him. You know, they're always given his input. I don't think he has an, an, ever has an original thought. Um, yeah, I mean, basically all he is. He's just, a real, he's just a real conflicted person, but he's also somebody who everyone looks up to. He's real noble like that. So. Gotcha. Yeah. So what message do you want this, audi this show to bring to the audience? Um, I think the show is it's real realistic, and the thing about the show is that if the, the way Susan Laurie Parks wrote it, it was to connect with anything that ever happens, like contemporary stuff. So, you know, no matter what race, what sexuality or gender you are, you can, you know, find a way to connect with the show, only because it has all of those contemporary issues in it. And um, we just want to deliver a, you know, a loving message. You know, you got to love your neighbor, you know, stuff yeah. like that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> gotcha. So how did you prepare for the role, Kyrie? Um, <laughs> I had to really like, uh, I had to really just like let myself be vulnerable, which I'm not ever mm -hmm. comfortable with. But I guess for the show, you have to really reach out of your comfort zone for it. And I guess for me personally, I just like, I make a, like a list of music that I like to listen to that, that helps me connect to the character. And every time before the show goes on, I just listen to the music and it helps me put my mind in place for the show. Gotcha, yeah. gotcha. So what does this role mean to you? It means it means a lot because everything I've done in this school has been comedic. And this is my first lead role like ever since I've started acting. And it's really it's really inspiring. And I have like br little brothers and sisters and you know for them to come to see me, you know, stand up, you know, for something that I believe in and something that you know they might even believe in. It's it's really like it's a blessing honestly. That's good. Yeah. That's really nice. In one word, how would you describe the show? Emotional. It's, re it's really emotional. Yeah. <laughs> it sounds like it. It really yeah. does. Well, thank you for your time, Kyrie. You can get your tickets for Father Comes Home from the Wars by visiting fosberg.edu theater dance. That's theater with an R-E, not an E-R. Or also by going to the theater box office, room 302 in the Performance Arts Center on Friday, mon on Monday through Friday, 9.30 a.m. to 12.30 p.m. They break for lunch and come back from 1.30 p.m. to 3 p.m. You can also call into the box office at 301-687-7462. That's all for this edition of Fosberg Live. I'm Melanie Finney, and we'll see you next time.